All right, welcome back to Bomb Battle, I mean Bomb Club Deluxe. So we're in the Crystal Caves. This is a game all about making one chain reaction to blow up all the bombs. And this world introduces the anti-firework here. These are optional objectives, but to get them, we actually do not want to hit them. So, we have this beach ball, which will knock everything to the- as, as far as possible. Like that. So, feels natural to put that baby bomb, which will get knocked here, as far as possible on the diagonal. As well as here, but then use an extra bomb to block the ice bomb from dropping. If I didn't have that bomb there, this ice bomb would go as far as possible and hit the anti-firework. And yep, now they didn't hit the anti-firework, so I get both of them. So there we go. But yeah, um, huge worlds and new mechanics are going to come up. We've already seen a ton of them, like this one explodes everything on the same island as it. We have an anti-firework here. Oh, I see. So look at that. If we try to get this uh, horizontal bomb, then it will hit the anti-firework as well as the real fireworks. So I kind of want to activate that from far away or indirectly. We also have that uh, ice bomb, which I think I want to do that. So the ice bomb gets knocked here and doesn't hit the anti-firework. We have also these, um, hmm, these hard hat bombs, which takes two hits to destroy. I would rather not do that. All right, looks like this will win. Um, let's just make sure. Alright, hitting off one hard hat, and then knocking that ice bomb away, so it doesn't hit the anti-firework, and there we go. Here's a bomb party level, I need to use every bomb in my inventory to get this one. Two anti-fireworks, and this must be hit last because there's a crown on it. Let's see. Ice bomb's here. So I can just do this to hit the middle bomb? But I need to use every bomb in my inventory, too. So, and that will block the way, which is kind of annoying. I almost want to hit this one, but maybe it needs to be in the middle then. But still, I need to find a way to use every bomb like that. And then this just... I, I'm putting this bomb in the island without any of the anti-fireworks on it, and this should win, right? I'll put all the bombs away from their anti-fireworks. Oh, no, 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 because I need to hit that last shoot. Okay, then hitting that has to be more indirect. Okay, so instead I'm going to put it up here, and then have the ice go down. So what will happen is I get everything, and the ice goes and knocks down this, and this will be the last bomb to get, get rid of, and I didn't hit any of the anti-fireworks. Cool, next level is a landscaping level, which means that I can connect any of the ground as much as I want to. However, I'd probably want the ground away from these, if possible. These ice bombs need to go away fast. The seed bomb hits... All from four directions, but does not hit gap, uh, over gaps on the terrain. This bomb needs to be exploded last. So I need to- I want to arrange that, like, almost like this, maybe? So that these ice bombs get knocked away. Hope that works. And both ice bombs get knocked away from the anti-fireworks, and there we go. Cool. Next is the Mega Bomb level where I need to destroy this bomb in three different turns because it's three HP. I have a party hat bomb, which will destroy when any other bomb on the same island is destroyed, as well as these, which cannot be exploded, otherwise I lose the level. Well, there's a lot to avoid in this level, but this should be able this hits everything in the same row, which is kind of good. Hmm. No, wait, does it's not good because of that. So what did I, what have I possibly use this for? I also, this is a starter hat, which means that I need to start the chain reaction with this. Annoyingly, it is not even in range of this, but oh well. Hmm. So do I do that, and then that, and then what? And here. Isn't that three hits already? Let me just try. Oh, no, 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 the problem is... No, wait, there's no problem. They do explode different turns. Well, don't need to use any other bombs in my inventory, even though I had one. All right. Cool. I was gonna say, um, the health doesn't go down if it goes down in simultaneous turns. But I guess that didn't matter in that puzzle. Okay, we have this bomb, which is hitting an anti-firework. We do not want that, so we need to block it. Also want to destroy this bomb, but it's just hitting a vertical, which is really bad. So, I'm instead gonna beach bomb it away. Hit, 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 and hit. There we go. Hit that. 
It's the beach bomb, which moves it to the side. And there we go. Another mega bomb level. Right, so this needs five hits. Again, all on different turns. As well as these. Wow, what the hell? I can't explode them. Does this block it? Yes. Bombs block the explosion there. So, I mean, what am I going to do? Just block it over and over? There's also one to the side, which implies that I'm going to go to the side here and connect it, right? So do whatever chain reaction is required for me to hit the side of that, because otherwise I guess I don't have the turns. Hmm, it doesn't feel right. Maybe this? I mean, something definitely still feels wrong about that, but we can we can try it. Explode goes down by one, and see that's the problem. Both of them have exploded at the same time, and I accidentally destroyed a doom bomb, which uh, two problems there. Maybe we alternate them. This also has less room, by the way. Um, I noticed that to uh, to go. There's only two squares here and three here. That would explode here. And then we would want like, like this to the side, I guess. And then we would have this. How much is this right now? It's one, again, explodes. Okay, so it would go on separate turns, which is a good thing. And we would only have one hit left. So blockade that. Hmm. Hold on, I can just do this and then use another firebomb to block. That's cool. Now the problem is, very likely I'll have a simultaneous for an issue. Yep. Yes, I do. Hold on. All I need to do is start the chain reaction from here instead, right? Well, there we go. I feel like I might have even used one extra bomb that I needed. But there we go. And didn't hit any of the dooms up over there. After this level, I'll show two more bomb types. So that'll be cool to see. Hard hat bomb. This is a huge problem. We do not want this to hit the anti-firework. Or this. What? How are these... This, this looks impossible to not hit the anti-firework. Oh, right! Landscaping, duh! Alright. So this is a magma bomb, which will explode everything on the island, so that's not good to have. We want to separate that. But these can go, like, far away. So we can do that, and then hit... And, and then use that to hit the diagonal, and hit this hard hat bomb. Um... Actually, the more restrictive one is this bomb, which needs to go, like, away, and it can't go away here or here because it would hit the anti-fireworks, so it needs to go away in this sort of diagonal, and neither diagonal is especially satisfying. Actually, aren't diagonals not counted as, um, part of the same island? So I can do that. I'll split that just for simplicity's sake. And yeah, you can see it's not hitting the same island. Now, I will have an issue that, um... I will have the issue that I, need, that I still need to start both chain reactions, and I definitely don't want that hit. So how is that going to get knocked? Oh, I know! We connect this to here, but nothing else on it. So now the magma bomb will come and explode this one too. That is nice. There we go. And no anti fireworks hit. Okay, two new bomb types. I'm really looking forward to these. So... Crystal Caves. Well, this, I mean, duh, it's Crystal Caves. Are you a 3D bomb? The game's already 3, uh, well, kind of 3D. A magnet bomb? Alright, where's the end? <laughs> Repelled away. Hmm. Ian? Okay. Ian, are you here? Yes, it's a chick. Alright, yes, yes, yes. Anyway, magnet bombs. So these must be the, the push away variant of... Oh, that's a nice animation too. That's the push away variant. Is there a pull towards variant? Anyway, of the other push away bombs. Okay, but you're a meow. So... Bomb Battle Advance. Okay. So let's see. What do we have? Two Magnet Bombs. That will push away, I believe. This one also, like, hits everything the horizontal. 
So here we don't want this to be pushed away, so maybe we- I don't know why we would want to double it up though. But oh wait, we can do that! Nice! We can do that, and then this also hits the firework. So then we don't need to worry about it for this one. Oh, this was a poor showing of the magnet bomb, considering like, the first move doesn't really push anything away. Or it doesn't need to push anything away. But anyway, we, we got the firework and the anti-firework, so there we go. Alright, let's see the next one. Here. The, oh wait, wait, that's a new world? Alright, get, get baited. Holy crap, that is two worlds ahead. I'm not gonna do that yet. Alright. Well, I don't know, maybe the thumbnail could look even more cursed. But anyway, magnet bombs. Push this away. Blocking this. Is that fine? And then this one we can just get partied. No, no, this is gonna... Okay, I see. So I need to put that in there, otherwise this will push it and then not hit the firework. So there we go. Push as far as possible, and there we go. Triple Trouble. This is three variations of the same level in increasing difficulty. Two bombs. Does this one feel like it hits this one and this one, or... Hmm. Feels like a distractor. I would push that opposite here. Does that work? That feels kind of bad, too. Oh, no, no! When I do that, it'll push this to here. Ah, uh, this will work for sure. There we go. Alright, next. We got a beach ball this time. A beach bomb. I can still do this move. And this will go over gaps as well, so we'll hit this too. Hmm. I'm missing something. Like this can this can even hit here, which is nice. We can start the chain reaction with a beach bomb here and knocking here here, but um how am I gonna activate that? I guess here, because it hits everything. Sure, I guess. And we have just have one bomb left, because why not? Right, this should work, I think. There we go. One bomb was felt a little superfluous. Next one. This can hit every everything. Hmm. Beach bomb, can you help? Doesn't even seem like it. This will go here, it'll push this bomb away to here. Knock this here, and then what do we do with the last row? Basically nothing possible. So maybe the beach bomb needs to like... Wow, there's like so few to do here. Three bombs. Oh right, it's a freaking push. I, I was trying to get the diagonal to be used somehow. But for some reason I couldn't come up with the idea. Here. And then that push will get to this top right one. That is a nice level. Okay, final level of World 8. I believe this is a normal level again. We have a bow, and bows all explode at the same time. Once one bow is exploded, the other one will at the same exact time. These are weird. These need to be pushed away or something. Like, I need to do that and that so that the anti-fireworks don't explode, but is there anything else I should do? Like, there's definitely something weird with the middle bomb in the center, too. Hmm. Okay, so this can connect here. That seems to do everything. I mean, I don't even know why I need the other bomb, but okay. We'll just arbitrarily put it here. Oh, do I need to... No, I don't. I don't think so. The weird thing is that this does fire over all the... Oh, oh! Freaking fool. Alright. You gotta block it. It's funny that this fires over gaps, but it doesn't push over gaps. But anyway, yeah. I need to block that so we hit the correct target. There we go. Uh, the correct row, rather. And very good. No anti-fireworks hit. Alright, it's World 9 time. Temple of Wind. So, new bomb type. This looks very special. Fake bombs? That's like regular boxes. <laughs> Lol. Weird. What's the point of non-exploding bombs? Quality content. Yes. Can we make the flora bomb?
thanks, Blake. Why did you introduce this? What? What, what happens when you explode it? Classic. Okay, I guess they're just blockers. Can they be pushed around, I guess? If I do this, will it push it around? Yes, it still will. Hmm. Well, we got this beach bomb here. I don't want it to hit here and then hit here, here. I want to avoid this getting hit, so we just want to need a generic blocker or something. It's gonna hit here. So we need to find a way to deal with whatever this is. Um. That's, that is odd. I think the magnet one is the one that tries to push it, but doesn't actually push anything. Like that. Wait. No, no, we need a blocker on the very top left. I, for some reason, thought that this baby bomb would hit, but no, we have to do this. And then all those blockers prevent everything, and the anti-firework does not get hit. There we go. Next level. I see there's another bomb type coming soon. All right, anti-firework, doom bomb, and this. This is the one we actually want to hit, but we don't want to hit any of these. Hmm, this one looks like looks like this is the pipe puzzle. This is pushing the, this junk all out of the way. Probably we'll push it as far as possible too. Hmm. Although, do I understand this level well enough? Oh, what? What happened there? Looks like we got some simultaneous action because this, like, huh. It, we didn't get the time to push this far away enough, which was not good. Hmm. So then what, we have a blocker here, and then we bow these so they explode at the same time. Alright, guess we're just not going to use, you know... We're not going to use two bombs, because, uh, why not? <laughs> Alright. Okay, next, and already a new bomb type. You do? It's a smoke bomb. Okay. What are the dark times? Alright. Oh, come on! That's disappeared, too. We don't speak of the dark times, okay? Alright, so... Doom Bomb, we don't want those to explode. Hmm. Doesn't, okay, it doesn't matter because whenever we hit that, everything will turn into mush. Alright, Grey Goo Bomb. B B dystopia episode, anyway. <laughs> this plot is nuts! Oh my gosh! And what, did you use the Grey Goo Bomb to get rid of it? Thanks! <laughs> that explains the, the anime villain costume too. Amazing. Just... Unbelievable. So... Interestingly, it was it's very interesting that the firework can get Grey Goo too. Does that mean... I'm going to guess the animation of the firework exploding up implies that we don't want to Grey Goo the Firework. I don't know, how does this interact with like everything else? Like if I Grey Goo this, will it mean that I don't need to worry about the crown restriction anymore? And like, what about these? I mean, I guess I just don't want to hit them. It's like perfectly valid to just don't hit them. Hmm. I don't know what island to hit. Okay, here's another idea. I'm gonna Grey Goo this. That, um, actually, shoot, which, how does this get activated? I'm just gonna activate this way. Um, still we're gonna hit this bomb, actually, which is not good. Um, not, I do not have a good idea how this is gonna work. Like, let's watch them turn into Grey Goo. The, why is the crown still there? I thought the hats would all disappear. Well, we obviously can't explode a crown bomb. Or I guess, like, later levels will explain it, because uh, I don't know right now, but we can at least get rid of this and Grey Goo away this bomb. And then we'll hit, um, well, I, I think we hit this one last. Look, I'm just going to do this, and hopefully everything will work. And there we go. We've protected that Grey Goo. 
Um, we protected that Doom Bomb from being hit. And there we go. Well then. Landscaping. Ray Goo here. So. Okay, now I want to see this. Ray Goo everything. Congratulations. Not bad. Or it, it does not count as getting the fireworks. So. Um, <laughs> although we destroyed all the bombs, we also destroyed everything else, um, including the fireworks. So don't do that, because we want them. I mean, destroying these definitely seems like a, an awesome plan, but I definitely want this. Like, this firework is always going to be next to the Doom Bomb. I, there's no way to avoid that. So even if I, like, try to connect all the rest of these together into the Grey Goo Bomb, I'm not going to be satisfied by this, so this will need to be exploded some different way. Okay, so I'm going to put a baby bomb here. This will also explode somewhere outwards and try to hit this firework only, but not that- Well, it's fine if that hits it if I get the firework on the same turn or first, probably. Let's see this. Will this work? No, the the gray goo happens first. Okay, alternatively, every part of the action will be on diagonals. This looks like it's good. Because then this will, this will not connect to the rest of anything. So, boom. That's clever, too. Like, the gray goo can't affect it because we diagonally split the islands. And there we go. Wait, I didn't get that. Oh, come on. Oh, no. <laughs> hmm... No, wait, all we need to do, I think, is make it irrelevant by connecting that island to here. So then we don't have to worry about it anymore. Cool. That is a good level. Next is a bomb party level, meaning I need to use every single bomb in my inventory. There are a lot of these here. I want to explode these first. That's probably the idea but somehow without hitting anything, anything bad. Don't hit over gaps. This one does hit over gaps. I'll have gotten the firework all already, I think, by the time I hit this, so that's fine. Then I explode this. And then what, Grey Goo blocks everything else? Does that just work? Oh, this is annoying. I'll try this just in case. Well, not just in case, like the... Anyway. I didn't explain myself well at all, but anyway. One of the bombs seemed a little superfluous, but we got both fireworks, and there we go. Alright, next up is the temp- Bow bombs, and we need to start clicking this bomb due to the red uh, starter button hat. These will explode at the same time because they have the same bow on them. Hmm. There's some doom bombs that seem like they're designed to- What is going on here? I don't want to gray goo the firework. Hmm. It's also, obviously, this needs to be on the same horizontal hit this. Unless it's like here and then there's a baby bomb there. I don't know. Hmm. What's going on with this thing? This is so weird. It feels like we want to like stack these and then put, I don't know, like here. Just so that we don't. Just so these all disappear. Because these seem like a huge problem. Alternatively, it's like something like this, and then we still Grey Goo it. So then these all will block the fires of these. It's, um, no, that will not hit anything yet. Hmm. I really wanted to hit, like, the side of that. Oh, there's still a big bomb left. It's good. Does this work? Okay, and all these are blocked, and that means that none of these will get hit, so they're cool. Next up. Goal of this is to hit 12 of these bombs, uh, at least for the gold. And there's some of these, I guess. Hmm. So magnets, which will push away stuff. Hmm. This already seems like a lot, but I do want to hit them all. Oh, okay, here's the key move I was freaking missing. I was looking at this for so long, but I didn't see it. It's this, because it gets pushed here. Okay, this should make it easy. 
and then we block it once. Is that all we need? Surely I'm missing something, but anyway, push to the side. What the heck? Why? Why'd you go there? Why'd you go there? Oh, because, okay, there we go. Cool. So can we rename the game to Non-Bomb Club if this is- anyway. All bombs clear. I think this is the first, uh, level of this type where you actually do get rid of all the bombs for gold. Usually can miss some. But yeah. Okay, next one is Text of Speed, where I need to beat all those as fast as I can. So I feel like I'm gonna fail it. Anyway, Grey Goo Bomb here. I need to just choose which bomb that I actually need to hit. Uh, that's not gonna hit the Grey Goo Bomb. What? What? How do I hit that? Oh my gosh. No, come on. I need to pick which one it will actually hit the Grey Goo. Ah, oh, this is embarrassing. It would have been better if I just decided to, like, um... Just choose the random bomb, because it's already spent so much time. Alright, Seed Bomb can't hit that. No, here. It does not seem like I even have to worry about the Doom Bombs. It seems just like a distraction. Here? Nope. Great Goo Bombs hit everything on the island, which means I don't care, I just hit that um, Great Goo Bomb and it works. Uh huh, Beach Bombs everywhere. That'll land all the way here and not hit anything good. That looks like it hits a lot. I just hit that one. Alright. Yep, all I did was like, oh this hits a lot, therefore good. Great Goo here. Hit that, but I'm not hitting that one. Crap. Okay, this one looks good because it hits this one and then both Grey Goo Bombs. There we go. Three hard hats, huh? I will hit the one at the bottom. What? 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 Excuse me? Oh, maybe this one automatic. What? Maybe this one needs to move to the side. That would make some sense. Alright, there we go. I need one more to get the... Alright, so... Great goo... Well, gee, it looks like you just hit that one. There you go. Okay. Even despite the screw-up early on, like, things have gone good. That one looked... Oh, shoot! Whoops. What did I hit? And how to not include the correct one? Shoot. Um, no. Just no. That maybe we'll hit it correctly. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Okay, I'm glad that um, I'm gl <laughs> I'm glad that I got gold before that disaster. I failed so hard at the early in the last level. Anyway, let's do um level nine nine, another landscaping level. Some doom bombs that I pr probably don't want to hit. An anti-firework that I don't want to associate with the goo here. Hmm. I have a great goo bomb. Honestly, I I kind of suspect that we're going all the way around for this, but I still want to trigger this one, which means this will probably need to be triggered on its own, like that. And then something happens that allows me to trigger the goo bomb from there. Is that all? Because I can't ignore basically everything else. Hold on, we need to connect that one. There we go. There we go. Hopefully hit the firework. There we go. One last one in this world. Beach bomb here. If these connected and both of them, I really do not like they're hitting these. Um, we have no goo to do anything with it. Also, we have this situation here. It seems fine for now. This one is really annoying. If we could get this out of here, that'd be nice. Um, or, like, we could do that and... When we do that, does the firework push? It does not push the edge, which is annoying. We would prefer that it did. Okay, it looks like the best bomb for this purpose is this one. If you hit this one, then both of the non-bombs get hit to the edge, and then this, then this situation is fine. Oh, I, I'm an idiot. Just use that, and that one will block the Doom Bomb from being triggered here, as well as put the Firework. 
for the rest of the puzzle, um, um, just, just don't, just don't do anything, right? Oh, what, what, how? Oh, because this triggered first. Okay, makes sense. I'll just block it then. Why do I need the beach bomb then? I keep doing puzzles with, like, entire bombs on you. That's ridiculous. I... I don't know if the Railbound game is, like, a good comparison, but... I remember watching videos of that and things were unused too. <laughs> so... It's looking not gonna happen, but it's gonna be funny if the last level is like, Did you know you could mix some of these unused? Then it's like, alright. Uh, anyway, Doom Bomb should never be detonated. Yep, and they can also wear hats. I think I've read this one too, right? Magnet Bomb detonates and repels everything. AK, it's a push again. It goes through every bomb and gaps. Used to attract. <laughs> it used to attract. Is there attraction gonna come? I honestly wanna know. The not, not bombs? Yeah, it can wear hats, even though half the hats in the game make no sense along with the fake bombs. Lol. In a farm up state? Yep, dummies that live on a farm. Does this- does any of these bombs actually make any sense on top of a freaking fake bomb? Anyway, smoke bomb. AKA Grey Goo Bomb. Yep. Freaking tinfoil hat? Imagine- Imagine if there's, like, no tinfoil hat in the game, it's just trolling. Anyway, Terrain Island, yep, it's the same. <laughs> Which is different from- how, What happens when you put a smoke bomb on a house? Alright, there's a mega bomb. Oh, right. Oh, I didn't even read any of these because we were so far down. Yep, they fit on four tiles, and can't be hit on simultaneous turns. Nice. Anti-tall propaganda. Lol. Color bombs. Yep. Oh, as far as the bomb club is concerned. So why don't you only use those that turns of paintball land? Optional fireworks. Yep. Can't be moved either. So it's just like the, the firework with the reverse. If there's any more here. Yeah, there's not. I mean, anyway, because this was only a bomb episode. Anyway, see ya.